nothing, I ain't heard nothing. What do you want, Vadim? I am glad you are willing to help. Unlike my deadbeat brother. Travis is a good guy. He deserves better life. I'd be happy to help. Okay, so Travis needs to believe in himself, yes? Believe he is capable of more. You know what works? You want to be part of helping Travis? You show up after six. Otherwise, we do it without you. Everyone just buys the beer, but we have plenty of other drinks if you're feeling brave. Who owns this bar? The Bo- uh -huh. uh, The Dean Bobrov is the loud one. You Not now. Okay. Drinks! The finest liquor moonshiners can brew right here. I'll take a look, sure. That's fine. Adim. Ah, yes, you. Famous bobber of liquor, on tap all day. You look tired. Need a room? Hey, Yefim. Need a room? I'll take it. You're in room two, just through the door. Have a nice day. You ain't gonna last once you leave the wall, so don't get chummy. I'll take your order whenever you're ready. Come, come, have a drink. I didn't buy bar to sell what? Maybe later. You know where to find. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, uh, um. Hi, there. Hey Maybe there, pal. I like your oh, little radio you. program. What you have to say? I'm about here to give that. you a hand. I, I, I mean. Hey there, pal. Oh, it's you. I'm here to give you a hand. I, I, I mean, I'm not really looking to cause, you know, trouble. I don't. I have no idea what I did to deserve this. I just wish they'd go away. Let's do something about this then. No, no, I, I that might end badly. With these men, it could, well, it, it, could, it could turn violent. Don't you want this to stop? Yes, but. Don't worry. I've got your back. Well, if you think it would work... Don't look at me. This wasn't my idea. Uh, okay, that's... If you have well, a moment, 
There's something I'd like That's to discuss enough. with you. Oh, I'm sorry. You say something. I said, I said, that's enough. Leave me alone. <laughs> Look at you. Hmm, let me think about that for a second. Um, nah, I don't think so. I, I mean it. I'd appreciate Leave a response, Slade. Well, sounds like you were thinking about saying, or else. <laughs> were you, Travis? Were you gonna say, or else? I'm wondering what comes after that. What you gonna do, little man? Uh, I'll beat you up! Big mistake, Travis. I'm gonna destroy you. You ignore people And often. your friend here. Uh, security! Uh, we need security! Uh, security. Uh, we need security! Uh, we need security. Uh, security. Uh, Hey this ain't over. You hear me? Get lost. Travis. Whoa. Hadim. What the hell is wrong with you? You were supposed to help Travis in fight, not murder people in my bar. Why would you think this is okay? It won't happen again. It can't happen again. Because they were the only two guys I knew willing to do this. Screwed this up big time. <sighs> I will try and fix the situation which you have made messing of. In meantime, I need you to not kill anyone and help with the rest of plan. Okay? You have seen Scarlet, yes? She has worked here for some time. Now, I am just simple bartender, but I see things. I see how Travis looks at her. And I see that sometimes she looks at him. If someone who was not her employer suggests that she go spend time with Travis, it might do him some good. I could have a chat with her. <laughs> yes, I know. This is why I'm telling you. Apparently, I also need to say, please do not be killing anyone. Okay? This is for helping Travis, not murdering for fun. Just do whatever it takes to get her to agree to see Travis, and this will all be worth it. And you and I never talked about this, all right? Hey, Scarlet. I'm on a break right now. Actually, I'd like to talk to you about Travis, if you have a moment. Travis? Really? Did he... Did he mention me? Uh, I heard about the fight. Travis was... Well, he was brave. Yeah, absolutely. You should really pay him a visit. You think? 
I mean, I've definitely noticed him. Maybe... No. No, I couldn't just go over there. What are you so nervous about? What's the worst that could happen? Believe me, I can think of some pretty horrible things. Look, I'm just not ready for that. Look, Travis is a nice guy. I can tell that you like him, and I think he likes you. Just go talk to him. Okay, I will. I'll go see him now. Thanks. to be an emergency. I prefer to go to the dugout in. Sure, I can afford the tap house. But the way those Yefim. people stay This is terrible. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. He was up to no good, and look what's happened now. You've got to help. I can't do it. You've got to help me. What are you talking about? I am talking about Vadim. They took him. Men came in. They said they were friends of the ones you killed. Uh, said Vadim owed them money because of what happened. He, he wouldn't pay. And then they grabbed him and said that they would make him pay. And then they just dragged him out. You have to do something. Please tell me you can do something. Do you know where they took him? No, I don't know. He's the one that uh, has always dealt with them. I've tried to avoid them. Travis might know. You should ask him, please. I, I don't want anything to happen to Vadim. going on I need your help Vadim's been kidnapped by friends of bull that's not funny I'm not joking around Travis this is serious I really do need your help wait really oh oh man wow is this this is because of what happened isn't it it's it's my fault no, Travis. This is between Vadim and those men. It's not your fault. But if I hadn't gotten into that fight with them, maybe this wouldn't have happened. Fault is irrelevant. We need to defuse this situation. Look, I don't, I don't really... I mean... I don't have a lot of friends. If Vadim is missing, or in trouble, or whatever, then I'm gonna help get him back. All right. I'd welcome the help. Good. I didn't... I didn't want to have to argue about it with you. I've heard enough to know they're probably holed up at the old Beantown Brewery. We've got to go in there, show them we mean business, and, and then we can bring Vadim back, and everything will be okay. Right? I'll... I'll get a gun, and I'll meet you there. We'll settle this.
Thank God. You're here. So this is it. Odds are, if they've got Vadim, he's inside. We're... Thank you. I didn't know if anyone would come. I thought perhaps this is the end. Uh, thank you, thank you. You are true friend. You're welcome, Vadim. We weren't gonna leave you to these guys. You are good woman. <laughs> these idiots had caps and cams just lying around. <laughs> they, they did not notice when I filled my pockets. You deserve what I took. Brothers, I am surprised to see you here. <laughs> hey, Vadim. I'm glad you're safe. How did you get roped into this? I, I wasn't forced or anything. I wanted to help. <laughs> you are full of surprises, my friend. <clears throat> Man, what a day, huh? Hey, listen. I wanted to say thanks. This has been, well, it's been crazy, but I've learned a lot, I think. You came through it all pretty well, Travis. That's good to hear. Thanks. Your contributions were acceptable. After all this, I think about the things that had me worried so much, and it just seems silly, you know? Like, was I really that worried about just being on the radio? That's nothing compared to being beaten up, shot at. I can do so much more. And I need to. Anyway, thanks again. I owe you.